Welcome back everybody to Tulio Studio and today is the second half of how we make barley from onward out of polymer clay. So let's get started. So I've got some pictures here and just trying to get different views of him. using some black paint and with this we're going to make his badges he has all over his over the front of his vest Using some white and some more black. I'm gonna use some orange. His badges on his vest are usually just orange, black, and white. Those were the only colors I could really see from the pictures I got for reference. Okay, so once all that paint dries, now I'm working on the head. So just try, I'm just trying to get a good sized chin. I'm cutting off the back of it and that will be so that the back of the head will fit nicely. Chopping off the top. Go just making sure the clay is nicely blended with the dry clay or the baked clay. So I'm really trying to go for a bigger chin look. So here we've got his cheeks. Just trying to blend them with the other clay. There we go. Now, just working on the nose. Now, just blending his nose with his face. And with his face, I'm using the same clay I used for the other parts of his body. Just a light blue made with blue and a little bit of white. I'm trying to make the bridge of his nose a little bit smaller. Just chopping off a small amount. There we go, that's better. Now this will be his forehead. Blending that with the clay too. Making sure that looks good. Just chopping off the top of it because we don't need too much because we're also going to add his hair and his hat. Adding little pieces of clay and those will be for his eyes. Cutting off just the bottom half because he's got his eyes slightly closed. Adding his mouth, adding the white to his eye. Just adding the black to his eye, his eyeball. Now I took some pink and blended it a little bit at the edge with some blue for his ears. Just trying to make a nice long triangle. He's got very long ears. Adding those to the edge of his face, sides of his face. So after you've made both ears, we're going to move on to the hair. And this is a lighter type of blue. I don't remember what its name is exactly. So he just did his eyebrows and working on his hair. And I'm texturing his hair with his tool. We want to get that nice hair texture. Now we're doing the other side. We're doing the other side pretty much the same, maybe a little bit shorter. Just 
cutting off the back of the hair to make room for the hat. And I took another piece of clay and I put it on the back and this will be the back of his hair. Just texturing that too. Now I'm taking some normal blue clay and I'm putting that on top of his head. And this will be the hat. Just making sure it fits. Now I'm just texturing that a little bit. Adding a little bit of a line to make it look like it's been folded backwards like it is in the reference pictures. Okay, now once that's baked, we can glue the body to the shorts. Using some super glue works really well. Now we'll, try, now we'll be gluing the legs to the shorts. Just doing one leg and then the other. Now we're doing the hand with the cup. Adding a small dab of glue. We don't want too much. Now the other hand, or arm. Now we're gonna make the straw to his cup. So I'm just cutting a small piece of wire, making sure it fits. Yep, I think that's long enough. Just adding a small dab of glue onto it, and sticking it in the I painted the straw white and now I'm adding some gloss glaze to his eyes, his badges, and a little bit to the cup. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's tutorial on how we made barley from onward out of polymer clay. Make sure to like or dislike with anything you like to dislike. Hit that subscribe button, like and comment down below. I'd like to see what your suggestions are for any future videos I should make. So see you guys in the next video.